Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Blessed are you, Father, Lord of heaven and earth. You have revealed to little ones the mysteries of the kingdom. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. At that time, Jesus exclaimed, I give praise to you, Father, Lord of heaven and earth, for although you have hidden these things from the wise and the learned, you have revealed them to the childlike. Yes, Father, such has been your gracious will. All things have been handed over to me by my Father, and no one knows the Son except the Father, and no one knows the Father except the Son, and anyone to whom the Son wishes to reveal him. The Gospel of the Lord. You remember the Gospel yesterday? Jesus was upbraiding the towns that he had been kicked out of. And so this gospel begins with, at that time. And I kind of talked about that a couple of weeks ago, of what at that time meant, and asked the people in the congregation, how would you feel about being booted out of three towns? And so you hear the response. He praises the Father. See? So, listen to what happens in another occasion in the same way. When the days for his being taken up were fulfilled, he, Jesus, resolutely determined to journey to Jerusalem, and he sent messengers ahead of him and on the way, they entered a Samaritan village to prepare for his reception there. But they would not welcome him because the destination of his journey was Jerusalem. When the disciples, James and John, saw this, they asked the Lord, Do you want us to call down fire from heaven to consume them? <laughs> that, you, you see the difference? You see the difference in the response. Now, James and John are like me, all right? And like most of us, when we are rejected. You know, we want to do it again. Punch back, that's right. <laughs> I didn't even say it. She had, she had like... <laughs> but that, that's the way, but that's... That's our wounded nature. That's our wounded nature. And when somebody comes at us, we want to go, we want to push back. We want to push back. And yet Jesus doesn't push back. Jesus wants to draw us back. Jesus comes to reveal how the Father wants to draw us back. Not by pushing back, but by drawing us into relationship. Because Jesus is the mercy of the Father. Now you can better understand why Jesus called James and John the sons of thunder. <laughs> yeah. They were, they were the sun. They wanted to call fire down from heaven, you know. Give it to them. And in a certain sense, isn't that what we're really seeing in the world right now? 
We want to call fire down on people who come at us. And the real response, the only response to healing is Jesus. And that's why you hear in the gospel today Jesus praising the Father because he sees how the Father, okay, reveals himself. He sees, see, to the little ones. And so the gospel is always about emptying the self of self, becoming little, becoming small, so that God can raise us up and draw us deeply into relationship. 